Alright, so to start this all off, Bro is playing a runic deck, which if I'm being honest, I have never used or even uh freaking played against, so this was basically my first time playing against a runic deck. So you know, yeah. Either way, I he sets up, ends his turn, it's mine. By the way, he does love vanishing. Anyway, so here's how it goes. You already know through the setup, some of my monsters set my spells. He activates his trap, but I'm pretty sure it didn't really work. Because, you know, I didn't summon a monster. But, summon a monster. He negated my effect. He negated my he negated my monster's effect, which also banished some of my cards. You're going to see a lot of banishing. I also did not read that, I'm guessing, because I still activated my monster effect in the future. Anyway, I freaking activate my spells effect. He activate his his field spells effect. And then I'm pretty sure that allows him to put it back in the, yeah, in this deck and draw. And then I destroy this monster. He puts his monster back in his collector deck and you already saw. Luckily I was able to summon a better monster and just attack him. Which gives 2300. Anyway. Now he sets up, activate his card. I activate my trap card to destroy his field spell. Luckily, it destroys the field spell. But he was able to summon a monster and bring back his field spell to his hand and set it back down. So, yeah. Oh yeah, so, for some reason, I don't know why, I'll probably have to look in more about runic type stuff, because I've, ne again, never duel against runic monsters, so you know, can't really say stuff, but he was always, his battle phase was always skipped, so I can't, so I, and I don't really know why, it was probably, uh, this dimen, oh, never mind, not dimensional fissure. But either way, I don't know why, so you know, yeah, I'll have to do a little more research on that. Anyway, I draw some of my monster, but then he activates his trap, which banishes my monster. But luckily, I was still able to spring back my field spell, which will allow me to freaking summon shit. Well, not summon shit, more like freaking bring it out. Draw card. There we go. Anyway, you already saw do my whole spell attack technique for my punk deck but literally we were on neck and neck kind of. anyway he banishes my stuff using his his card cuz that's usually how this goes and then he, and then he fucking if i remember correctly he banishes he ba he destroys my one of my spells and banishes like four five more cards four more cards like bro that was painful bro so you know I'm being cautious so I just set my card in defense activate and just just being cautious because I don't know what to do that my friends is a surprise tool that will help us later. Anyway, for my opponent's next turn, he draws and just ends his turn. Er, yeah, he ends his turn for some reason. Anyway, I draw. That's a surprise tool that help us. Now let's cook. At this moment in time, I'm locked in. I'm ready. I already know the goals. My my goals are beyond your understanding at this point in time. So I just decide to cook up, use Harpy Feather Duster, erase everything, just set up, activate effects, draw more cards, activate my field style, draw more cards. You see this shit? I am being prepared, and then I summon my Ogre Dance, if I remember correct. Yeah, I summon my Ogre Dance, and then Synchro Summon to summon my Amazing Dragon. And then send his shit to the extra deck and then summon my boy and now we're just ready sadly 
not fully defeating it, but getting down to like 900. And then I fusion my uh, freaking carp, which allows me to summon more monsters. Well, better monsters at least. But yeah, also boost my uh, amazing dragons and stuff. Anyway, I am literally set up and decked out at this point. The only way I'm. <laughs> oh, yeah, I still activate my this effect, which allowed me to fusion to think or something. Think or summon my, uh, my dragon drive. Yeah, my dragon drive. Sadly, destroys my, my spell stuff. But it don't matter, because I am still prepared. I summon back my ogre dance anyway. And I am ready to cook. That does not stop me, because he... And that's where the freaking uh, Ash Blossom, because he was going to use card destruction, which if I remember correctly... Yeah. Yeah, allows me... makes me freaking discard a lot of cards. Which, sadly, he doesn't have any cards, but I have cards, and, you know, I did not want to lose them. And now, after skipping his battle phase again, I summon my monster, set my stuff, you already know how it is, ready to cook. I battle, he activates his effect, I negate the effect, but it doesn't work, but I still get the attack point, so I guess it did? But it didn't even matter, because he freaking surrendered. GG's, boys. Oh, and before I forget and, say, and don't say anything, don't worry, I am still working on the... Uh, freaking Eldritch. It's just that I'm trying to fix up my deck. It's not the best of decks, so I'm trying to see which deck would at least get me uh, good scores. Because the current one that I have isn't really good. It's actually kind of sad. So I'm working on it, but once I'm done, new thumbnail and you will see it soon. How soon? Don't know, but soon.